this is a transformer, a variable transformer, from 0 to 260 volts. Right now, I'm using it for 110 volts. This is the control. I control this on and off right here. So it's also an emergency in case I need to stop, in case my goal is burning up or anything like that. Inside, you will see a few wires, a contactor, and a transformer, and some blocks, some wire blocks. There's your contactor. There's your transformer. That is a MOT, a microwave transformer. It takes in 120 volts. It cranks out about 2200 volts at maybe 3 amps. I've tried neon transformer, but the amperage is too small. And the voltage is there, but the amperage is, is too small. And we all know the power behind electricity is the amp. Now, how does this work? So basically, this box is only control, on and off. You got 110 volts, it goes in right here. Then 110 volts would come back out here and go through these wires inside the box. Okay? But I'm making these for three months. I've noticed I only need 35 volts. So basically, I do not need this guy. I just need a regular little transformer at in between 0 to 35 or maybe 40 volts of AC. So instead of this big ugly son of a bitch, I can use a small transformer of 110 in and 35 out VAC. Then basically what it is, it comes in here, it goes through these these contactors, then it goes through the MOT, and the MOT makes this high voltage on this side, goes right here through these wires, high voltage wire, then it goes through the gold right there. That is half inch of gold. Right here, I put some tape so that way it will insulate, you know, so that way I won't get no zap in between. This is a two liter, look like a coffee mug, and uh, inside is two liter exact water. It's pure H2O water. Let's turn it on and see how this puppy works. Basically, this all right here is made out it's made out of plastic. It's made out of it's made out of it's made out of polyethylene. This thing needs a lot more work. It takes a few adjustments. And there it goes. It sparks. Never stick your hand in there. You're going to get a shock of your life, literally. Let's look at this. It's in the water. Right now, from the looks of it, sparking too much. So, I need to back it off a little bit more. I made this part adjustable. There's a spring right there. So when I screw this in, it opens up this side and this side. That makes me do an adjustable to it. You know what I mean. So, this is a very simple process. Real simple process. I can make this completely I, I can make this completely automated. I just have well, I just don't have the time. And maybe it's part of laziness. But it works. I made a few batches. It works great. I'm not doing production. I'm just doing for my use. And, you know, like family and friends who needed it. A whole lot more than me. I give them some. Um, you see? Well, there you go. It turned off a little bit. So you got to do an adjustment because the gold is wearing out. Then you adjust it just a little bit more. You gotta watch this puppy for like an hour. So, and that's what it is. Call I little goal maker. Hope you enjoy it.
it will take an hour to make a 2 liter of collatable water. That's a long time. You have to watch it. Well, I hope you enjoyed this video. Leave some comments behind. Thank you.